setting up uh, an independent national public inquiry was uh, one of the uh, first priorities of uh, this government when we uh, got elected uh, about 18 months ago and uh, we engaged in uh, consultations uh, and uh, were um, took very seriously the responsibility of putting forward this commission. Um, I have heard uh, the concerns that people have highlighted and indeed uh, the Minister of Indigenous Affairs, uh, Carolyn Bennett, sat down uh, with uh, the commissioners uh, this week to talk about the path forward. But I can also reassure people that we are not waiting for the end of uh, the National Public Inquiry into Missing and Murdered Indigenous Women and Girls to take concrete actions to counter uh, this uh, injustice that unfortunately continues to be ongoing. Uh, whether it's stepping up uh, on the fight against uh, domestic violence and uh, gender-based violence as we are, uh, whether it's working with child and family services uh, across the country uh, to uh, provide better supports to young people and communities, uh, or whether it's concrete actions like working with the province of BC uh, to uh, help with transfer, uh, transportation along the Highway of Tears. Uh, we uh, continue to take this uh, process extremely seriously uh, and uh, are looking at ways of uh, improving the way that uh, we engage uh, with this important issue with, uh, with Indigenous Canadians and all Canadians. What is your personal message to those families who have lost complete faith in the process that you ordered up? Canada has, uh, for decades now, uh, dealt inadequately with um, what is an ongoing national tragedy. Uh, the inquiry needs to provide justice for the victims, healing for the families, uh, and put an end to this uh, ongoing tragedy. Um, it is, uh, it was always, uh, and will always be, and would always be a very difficult process. I have um, had the uh, privilege of uh, sitting uh, down with um, families in various ceremonies across the country over the past years uh, where we've cried and shared stories and looked for hope and healing. Uh, and I think everyone recognizes the tremendously difficult task uh, that uh, any national public inquiry into this uh, was going to face and uh, we continue to be engaged with this inquiry to uh, ensure that it is responding to the very real needs and concerns of uh, so many families who are uh, bereft of not just of their loved ones but of uh, answers and justice.